Hey everybody, welcome to another video. In uh, today's video, um, actually before I begin the video, first I would like to give a big shout out to all our new subscribers. Thank you so much. Let's give them a hand everybody. Yes. Yes. Thank you so much guys for subscribing. Um, we've been trying to put out these helpful videos out here um, on the YouTube and I'm glad you guys um, enjoy them. So in this video, what we, what we want to talk about is basically resetting up. It's like the number one thing that most people ask us here at the store. Um, it's basically resetting up your radio to your vehicle. Like let's say for instance your throttle is working and your steering isn't working. Um, you you want to do like a, a reset on the radio to the actual vehicle itself. Super simple to do. I'm going to show you step by step on how to do it. So let's begin. Um, first thing that you want to do is here's the, the vehicle. This We're using a, a Traxxas Slash. So this is the Traxxas radio. Um, TQ, TQI here. So um, here's your power for your ESC, right? So what you want to do is uh, you want to first bind the actual radio. So to bind your radio to the car, let's say you change your receiver, you want to link it up. You're very simple. You're going to simply hold down. Uh, I'm going to try to see if you can see this here. Can you see the, yep. You're going to hold down the set button. There's only one red one here on this particular radio. It says set. You're going to hold down the set button. You're going to turn it on as you're holding it. Boom. As you do that, um, you're just gonna let go, it's gonna flash red, right? As you can see, I'll leave this here so you guys can see it flash red. Here's the vehicle itself. Let me move this out of the way. Okay, here's the vehicle itself. What you're gonna do is you're gonna hold down on the receiver, the little link button. Um, on the little link button, as you hold it down, then you turn power onto the vehicle here. Oh, this control, here's connectors in the way here here's the power button right there so I'm holding down the link and then I'm pressing this boom as you can see as I did that the actual light turned green so that means that it actually bind it up we're gonna test it up so we're gonna lift the back end it's a rear wheel drive hit throttle there it is it's working perfect and then we're gonna test the steering there it is it's working nicely Okay guys, um, now what we want to show you is how to uh, factory reset your radio to your vehicle. So we're not binding it, we're factory resetting everything. So um, what you want to do to factory reset your radio, very simple, it's going to have power on here, on the vehicle. Okay, so what I like to do is, well not like to do, this is what you're supposed to do. So let me move the car out of the way. What you're going to do is you're going to hold down the set button. Boom, you're gonna hold, as you're holding the set button, you're gonna turn power onto the, to the radio. You're gonna keep holding it until this light actually um, changes color. You're gonna see it change, there it is, boom. Once it's green, you let go. Next thing you're gonna do, you're gonna hold it to the left, press the button once, it's gonna flash quickly twice, you're gonna go to the other side, press it again, it's gonna go red. You're gonna go throttle, press it once, boom, and then you're gonna go all the way up, which is reverse, press it. Press it again. As you can see, it just reset it as I was actually doing uh, reverse. There it is. I usually have the car on a stand, you know, but right now because I was making the video quickly, uh, I just put it on the floor. And there it is. It just factory reset everything. Okay, so when you guys do do that, make sure that you have the car up in on a stand uh, because when you do uh, the final step, which is hitting your reverse there, it's going to link up your reverse. But that's how you do it, guys. So if you ever have an issue with, let's say, your throttle is working, and then you actually try to steer and the steering isn't working. I tried different things, it wasn't working for me. So what I did was I reset uh, the radio to the receiver and it worked perfect. So I hope that helps you guys and uh, good luck guys. Thanks for watching.